scrambling. He's like a crab, scrambling. He's scuttling across the shoreline, <laughs> trying to get this shark. Oh yeah, he is nice, man. Yeah, he's nice. He's nice. Yeah, he's a nice one. Don't uh, don't horse him. Definitely don't horse him. He's not done yet. He's not the biggest one you've seen. But he's big. He's nice. No, nah, he's big, nice, yeah. Big we'll get him on the beach and be like, oh. Yeah. Under. He's over Come here. over here. He's over here. He's not far, but yeah, it's just now a matter of, uh, this is where it's the worst, is right at that berm. He's significantly bigger than, uh, anything else. Oh! He nice, he nice. He nice. Don't let him go. Be careful. Let him come in. Glorious. Better from up here. not as big as that one you got no. last year. He is nice. He is nice. Oh, yeah. It is Damn. a bull shark. Ah, Definitely a bull that's shark. The that's the one that came from Ken Hape with Cape Yeah, I've got a picture of that. Oh. Woo. There he goes. <laughs> I got a tip for shark fishing right here. Any kind of surf fishing, here's the tip. Bag, right? You need a bag that you can throw your trash into. That's a good tip right there. Look at that. Dispose of that responsibly. Do not trash the beaches that you fish. You need to have etiquette. That's right. It's all about etiquette. If you like surf fishing, you gotta keep it clean. Always keep it clean. I did not look like a ray. Did not look like a ray. Oh, watch your rod, man. Watch those rocks. Oh, it did look like a ray. It did look like a ray, yeah. I don't know, we might have a ray here. A very strong ray. How deep of water do you think you were in? Ten feet. Yeah? I have some life on my rod. 
Something's swimming at me. Something just swam at me, and he's swimming out to sea, and I'm gonna hook him right here. There he is. There's a double hook up right there. Yes, sir. Ray? Sand tiger. Sand tiger's in the house. You gotta get it early, and you gotta get it big. That's nice, Romo. Is that six and a half? Seven? Seven? I'm not sure what I got, but. Yeah, I would be happy with a sand tiger like that. It's not the biggest you've ever seen, but it's still a nice one. Woo! Might have one myself. He's coming right in. Coming right in. Oh! My friend right there. Doubled up. Doubled up on the STs. Nice, nice. Nice. That's cool. Very cool. Uh, what kind of uh, hot pliers do you have? Give me those. Get that off the snaggle Here, yeah, <laughs> plier, 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 plier. I hope you didn't swallow it. Oh yeah, we got him. Earlier it worked, I put my hand on their head and they stopped flopping. He was able to get the hook out. Yeah, put the hand on the head. Alright, get it. nice double hook up a decent size sand tigers right there you need to find a good spot where you have 10 plus feet of water 10 feet of water you get 10 feet of water get it between 65 and 75 degrees that's what you're gonna get to produce sharks that's what you need to produce sharks and there are a bunch of places in New Jersey that you can do this I want to recommend you come here I mean you come here but uh, there's lots of other places lots of other places this place is very heavily trafficked there's a lot of pressure and uh, you can come check it out or whatever, but there are a lot of places you can go. 10 feet of water, 70 degree water, that's it. That's really it. He's been nothing but running for at least a minute and a half. I don't know if you noticed that. I noticed that. That he's been running for a minute and a half. He's dead weight. I can't even move that's, a, that's Ray? Ray? I don't think it's a Ray. No? I'm looking at Ray or at least a 150 pound shark. It's either a ray or a 200 pounder. When I hooked it, it was doing it. Yeah?
Yeah, dude, he ran literally for a minute and a half. Literally for a minute and a half. Oh, yeah. Triple header shark right there. I'm over it. Uh-huh. You definitely got a nice one because the amount of line you took off your reel. Yeah. Mine feels alright, but it's nothing crazy. I like to see that swirl though. That swirl's always good. Dude's getting low on line. I've never gotten as low, man. Probably a four and a half foot sandbar shark. We'll see. They're biting good today, dude. Wire. Huh? Yeah, wire later on. Yeah. No electrical tape. Don't need none of that. Oh, he's coming in. It's still got a minute, though. Maybe not a minute, actually. That's good. Ew, dude, look at the deformity. S turn. That's S turn, S turn right there. Uh, decent one. Really dark colored. Uh, we never measured them, but upwards of like six and a half feet, seven feet. Uh, sandbars at least, like brown sharks. The sand tiger's up to like nine feet. Yeah. The sand tigers, they're, they're actually fatter. They don't fight as good though. They, uh, they like lay there. Where these things like actually fight. I'm just gonna throw them back. Looks like some chaos. Lighting pretty well. A lot of head shakes. Great sand tiger. Right here. Swam right in at me. Right in the watch. Oh! That's gonna happen. That's gonna happen when you shark fish. You're gonna lose Damn. your fair shark sharks. Frustration <laughs> will be. Like it was all wrapped up. Yeah. Might have been like a. The frustration had set in at this point for Romo uh, when uh, he had lost his rig. Oh no, he rolled, dude. That's what, yeah. like five feet of shock leader. You yeah. got like six, seven feet of shock leader. Cut it. Yeah. He rolled on it or something. Fuck. He was rolling all around. You could tell he was rolling all around. Yeah. And that's uh, what's gonna happen uh, a lot. 